YouTube. This is Carrie Ann, also known as Vapor Madness on YouTube. So today I'm going to be doing another juice review. Today is going to be Cotton Candy from VikingVapor.com in 12 milligram strength, double the flavor. And I have it loaded in my K Italy B slash one model <laughs> cartomizer from Vapor for Life. It's a cool cart. And I have it on a regular battery, Kittery, whatever. And I wasn't, I just boiled this cart, just boiled it, boiled it, cleaned it, loaded it, all that good jazz. And I was getting no airflow, like none. It was horrible. So what, what I ended up doing is straightening out a paper clip. and just kind of pushed it almost through from each side trying to get you know working its way in and now I have great airflow so yay me for fixing something and not freaking out and going screw it throwing it away I just share that with you just so you don't say screw it and throw it away let's go ahead and get you a paper clip pull it out pull it apart push it through and it's fine I can put that in there in my case so let's go ahead and try out cotton candy um, I'm looking for vapor production throat hit flavor of course and I think that's just about all I really care about so I'm sure there are some other things in there that people look for but I don't really care about anything else so let's try vapor production That's good, that's nice, that's nice. Yeah, that's tasty. It tastes like cotton candy, sugary. It has that, I'm not entirely sure, I guess it just tastes like cotton candy. Somebody was arguing with my sister that cotton candy was its own flavor, but it is. They add cotton candy flavoring to the sugar to make it taste the way it tastes. What I like about the vapor is when you're eating regular cotton candy, the melting point's so low, your own body temperature in your mouth will liquidize it pretty much, and it has that warm taste feeling to it. Vapor has the same thing. It's still warm, so it gives you the nice feeling of actually eating cotton candy. So let's try throw it. getting much of a throat hit at all. Yeah, nada. So no throat hit on the cotton candy and 12 strength, 12 milligram strength liquid. I'm not getting anything. But the flavor is really good. The vapor production is nice. And I don't think I would really like a throat hit on cotton candy. I don't think that's really what I'm looking for on a sugar tasting liquid. I like throat hits on the coffee flavors and tobacco flavors, of course. But not on my really sweet stuff. So this is just where I'd like it to be. And I'm not complaining. I'm definitely not complaining of anything. I'm praising the fact that there is no throat hit. Nothing to make me cough. But other the other 12 milligrams do. The other 12 milligrams definitely make me cough. This is marshmallow, which I haven't done a review. I'm a little bitch. Which I haven't done a review yet for. Let me see if this gives me a throat hit. either. I'm not getting throw it on marshmallow. Mm -mm. 
another try cola and cream. And I'm not entirely sure why I'm doing this. Hopefully it's not too convoluted. I think it's the um, battery. So I know I get throw hits on my pass through with these. I just I don't think they're these. Oh wow. I think I spent way too much time on this. This was meaning to be just a but that is my juice review for cotton candy from VikingVapor.com. Overall, I give it I wanna go ahead and give it a three. It's got good vapor. It's got a it's got a great taste, but uh, I know some people want this throat hit, and I, I I wish there was a little something. I really do. Now that I think about it, and I'm going back, I'm like I wish there was a little bit of a throat hit, just so I can know it's there. But yeah, that's all I have time for. So thanks for watching. Bye.